Hey YouTube, Ron here with a uh, long overdue uh, lawn update. If you take a look, uh, this is the lawn after top dressing and after being cut with a real mower. Um, let me see, the top dressing was done in mid-July. So we're, like what are we now? We're like uh, August 24th, 23rd, something like that. So it's, it's been a few months and you can see that it's, it, uh, you know, definitely looks a lot more even now. The grass is starting to turn a little bit because it's starting to get cooler. I think it's, it's in the, it's in the um, low 50s this morning. So, and it has been for the last, last week or so. So you can see that it's not quite as green as it used to, but you can see like this, just the, uh, how level the lawn is, you know, overall. So let me go ahead and give you guys a shot of the back. Um, let's see here, the sun's out, so the video might not come out as, as nice, it's pretty bright. But you guys can see the back lawn overall. I mean, it, it, that came out pretty nice. It's, I mean, the lawn's a little wet because I watered it last night, or sorry, or early this morning. Uh, but yeah, you can see the results there. I mean, this is, this is, uh, let's see, so just for August, September, October. So this is three months post top dressing <clears throat> and, uh, and being cut, you know, really every four, four days, I mean, at, at, at the most. Uh, I haven't had to cut it as often um, here this, this past, in the past few weeks because, again, the grass just hasn't been growing as much. But, uh, but overall, you can see, I think it came out really, really nice. Uh, you know, I, I'm thinking that next year, it'll probably be just, I'll just probably aerate in the spring like, like usual and, uh, and not really do anything special. And probably the following year, so like a year, so like, so like you know, after... So let, give, give, give the grass all of next year just to, the lawn all of next year just to kind of heal and, and to have like a regular growing season. And then probably in 2018, uh, top dress again just to get it, you know, absolutely perfectly smooth. So overall, very happy with it. Again, it was a long process and, uh, you know, it, I, I think the results speak for themselves. I mean, it's definitely not an, an inexpensive process, but I mean, it definitely uh, makes the lawn look nice. So, you know, the, getting the grass, uh, getting the lawn top dressed uh, combined with... Uh, Regular real cutting really made a big difference, especially on the front. The front used to be really uneven. You can look here in this one section that I'm not really happy with, like right here in front of the tree, like right in here, that's still not quite even. And you know, that's, that's where like another set of top dressing will, will, will help. You know, I could probably just spot, spot dress that one area and, uh, and, and see how that, see if that would help. But I mean, it's, it's too late in the growing season now to do it. It'd probably be next, next year if I decided to do just that sm one area. But more than likely, I'll just wait until uh, 2018 to just redo the whole thing. So it was a quick update, and it's been a while since I've given you guys a video update. But I wanted to to let the, the lawn go until like pretty much it, it, till the end of the growing season, till till when it's beginning to turn, so you guys could see you know after three months of, of a top dress how the uh, how the the whole process worked out. So hope you guys found this useful. If you like this, please subscribe, share it with anyone else that you think uh, might benefit from it. And uh, you know, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below. I love getting comments and, and you know, responding to them. So uh, thanks again. Bye.